So while it's warming up, let's go ahead and start number two. How many socks are in the box? So we need to count how many socks there are total. Marina, how many socks are in the box all together? Count all the socks. There are 10 socks in the box. Okay, so we need to then circle the pairs. How many pair, or how many socks would be in a pair, Scarlett? No, 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 how many socks would be in one pair? Two. So you need to circle the pairs. So watch, we're gonna circle this one, this one, this one, this one, and then these two. Okay, so look how we circled that. We circled it a little different. Okay, so the first question was how many socks are in the box. Then they asked us to circle the pairs. How many pairs of socks are there? Daniela, how many pairs of socks are there? Five. There are five pairs of socks. Number three. Now, I never, when we do a hundred chart piece like this, I never go in order. Okay, so I never go in order. So you need to make sure you're looking up here as we're writing. Faden, looking at 35, what number would be right above it? 25. 25. Looking at 48. Lily, what number would be right above 48? Thirty-eight. Staying at thirty-eight, Alexa. What number would be right above thirty-eight? So it's ten less. Twenty-eight. Staying at twenty-eight. What number is between twenty-six and twenty-eight, Logan? Twenty-seven. Twenty-seven. Let's finish off. This top row, what number is between 23 and 25? Leo? 24. 24. Staying at 24. Dylan, what number is right below 24? 34. Staying at 34. Melina, what number is below 34? 44. Going back to 34, Abram, what number would be here? Adeline, what number would be here? 33. Going to 35, Kira, what number would be after 35? 45. After 35. I'm not going down yet, I'm just going next to. So what number comes right after 35? 36. Braxton, what number comes after 36? 37. Staying at 37, Sophia, what number would be below 37? 47. Eli, what number would be here? 46. 46. And Yazelle, what number is between 44 and 46? 45. 45. Your computer goes in order. I don't go in order. Okay, we need to divide these shapes into fourths. So we're going to divide them into four equal sections. Okay, so with my circle, I'm gonna draw a vertical line and then a horizontal line, and then I have four equal sections. For my square, we're going to draw two oblique lines to divide it into fourths. As always, ignore what comes up. Find the sums. 
20 plus 10. Logan, what's 20 plus 10? 30. Kira, what's 70 plus 10? You can use your 100 chart if you need to, guys. Number six, fill in the missing atoms. What number plus two equals ten? Adeline, what number plus two equals ten? Not seven. Fill in what number plus two equals ten? Eight. And Leo, what six plus what number equals ten? Four. Four. Okay, go ahead and turn your paper over. I'll read question number one two times. I think you have enough time to get your homework done before um, 